Developments now terrifying moments leading up to the emergency landing of an Atlanta bound flight this weekend. Tonight we're hearing from the Morehouse graduate who was one of several people who jumped into action to stop an unruly off duty um, airline flight attendant on that Delta flight. And we're hearing from a passenger who says he is grateful to be alive. Here's CBS 46's Barmel Lyons. We need the restraints. I am very thankful that it did not end badly. An off-duty flight attendant risked the lives of so many. A scuffle on a Delta flight from LAX to Atlanta forcing an emergency landing in Oklahoma City. The perpetrator was on the intercom and was telling passengers to return to their seat because auction masks were going to be required of them. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the captain speaking. We'd like all strong males. The the Passenger and Morehouse grad Rashawn Williams telling us his fight or flight kicked in. And I'm not weighing the pros and cons. I'm not thinking about everyone around me. I'm thinking this guy is having a meltdown in the middle of the sky <laughs> with all of these people on it and we need to restrain him. Posting this video to his Instagram story of him along with others holding the perpetrator down. So I immediately took the pressure off of him. And I said, hey, man, just calm down. Just don't move. Williams explaining to the off-duty flight attendant he's not here to hurt him, but keep him calm. But at first he's screaming and screaming when everyone's taking him down. And then he's apologizing after he's down, realizing, like, what's going on. He had no control over himself. Benjamin Curley says passengers told him the suspect was dressed quite oddly. He had a helmet on and um, uh, elbow and knee pads. And uh, the passenger he was sitting right next to, he was asking extremely personal questions of, and um, he said he even wrote a note and talked to the, the flight attendants, you know, blaming or accusing that passenger of being a hijacker. The terrifying madness in the sky, Williams and Curley believe, puts an emphasis on the need to address the mental health crisis. His actions cause such an emotional, volatile reaction from everyone around. They're not trained to deal with mental health breakdown. It becomes this whole big fight. It really brings light the need for um, a, a lot more awareness on the mental health crisis that a lot of people are having, especially aggravated by the pandemic. In Atlanta, I'm Barma Lyons, CBS 46 News. All right, on the